Um, I'm just in the middle of filming something. Can I? I'm not weird. It's like a cooking program. I'm not like doing weird stuff. French onion soup. What are you laughing at? Hey. Hey. French onion soup. Super easy. Really delicious. Um, one of my favourite things in the whole world. Perfect for a cold winter's day. Afternoon, in front of the fire. If you've got a fire, if you haven't, unlucky. Get a better job. Um, right, first job is I need to um, get these onions peeled and chopped and caramelised. You're protected in that, Charlie, yeah? Don't man... Oh, Charlie, seriously, bro. You're not an English teacher. Man got an E in English. Excellent. There was a... Um, you know Oasis, right? Yeah. Their guitarist, Bonehead, got a U in one of his exams. I told his mum it stood for unbeatable. Yeah, so I'm going to slice these onions. Make sure you take the root out and slice them fine. So we're going to get our butter melted, then we're going to get our onions in, melt them down nice and slow. A nice, nice pinch of salt. We'll season it in stages. Okay, so your onions want to go to kind of this stage and you'll see that they're catching on the bottom of the pan a little bit. I'm just going to pull some, some leaves and put some thyme leaves in there. You'd want to avoid putting the stalks in there because they're woody and you don't want to go through sieving through loads of chopped onions in your French onion soup. And then we want to add a splash of sherry vinegar. This is for acidity and then aspal cider and then just want to deglaze the bottom of that pan so get all those lovely burn, burny bits off the bottom. So I'm going to bring this up to the boil and then I'm going to add a little bit of flour just to thicken the end product up a tiny little bit but not a lot. You're probably looking for a tablespoon if that. And just keep it moving all the time and you'll see that it'll start to thicken. So let's have a little taste. Delicious. So now we season. So a good old pinch of salt and some pepper. If you don't want to make a beef stock, uh, you can get pretty good ones from the supermarket. Um, go to like the finest section where they're in the, the airtight packets. They're really, really good. Um, so I'm gonna pour that in. Now we need to bring that up to a boil and turn it down to a simmer. Let those flavors really intensify. Just tasting all the time. Adjusting the seasoning as and when. So the classic way to serve a French onion soup is with croutons on top, in the bowl, grilled, gruyere cheese. Mmm, nom nom deliciousness. So I've just got some par-baked petit pan. Small bread. Uh, and you just want to cut them that thick, a couple of centimetres, under the grill. We'll grill one side. Um, in fact, we'll grill both sides. Jamming. So I'm just going to sit those there until our soup's ready. So that's where I'm going to take mine to. Now, it's thicker than most French onion soups, um, but for me that's important because when they're all really wet and runny and they're just not that nice, this has got a little bit more substance to it, you can see, and we're going to pop it into these bowls. People will frown upon this, people will hate me, do a lot like I care. So pop your croutons on top, like so. And then just get the cheese on top. And what's going to happen is that bread's going to absorb some of that moisture from that beautiful soup. And this cheese is going to blister on top. You get involved and it's blooming delicious. So you want to be careful. Don't leave it under the grill. Stay there. Keep a watchful eye on it because you've just spent two hours caramelizing those onions and making that beautiful soup. You don't want it all to burn now. Ooh. Yes, mate. Look at that. Just dot a little bit of time on top. Just so you get that fragrant note when you eat. And that's it, mate. French onion soup, served classically. Twisted the recipe a little bit to make it our own, but it's absolutely delicious. You've got to try this. The recipe will be on the website. If you like this video, please give us a like, a share, and a subscribe. It'll be in the absolute world. Thank you.